Hong Kong has taken more steps to return to pre-COVID days, but tourism officials do not expect the number of visitors this year to reach pre-pandemic levels. Macy Mock reports. Hong Kong welcomed 55 million visitors in 2019, the year before COVID struck. With the city almost back to normal. Hello from Hong Kong. The government launched the Hello Hong Kong campaign ahead of the full reopening of the mainland border on Monday. But senior figures in the industry do not expect tourism to return to its former glory this year. Speaking on radio, tourism chief Kevin Yun said more visitors arrived after quarantine-free travel to the mainland resumed almost a month ago. But it will take time before tourists flood in. He noted that in the first year after opening up, other regions found that the number of visitors was 70 percent of the pre-pandemic level. Yuan pledged to keep helping the tourism sector. With the opening of the border with the mainland and with the expected uh, increase in the number of tourists uh, coming into Hong Kong, uh, we will continue to maintain the liaison with them and see any particular areas that they need more support from the government, both administratively and both from the system angle. Appearing on iCable's Let's Talk program, Tourism Board Executive Director Dane Zhang was also not optimistic. He said like other places, Hong Kong is facing a lack of flight capacity and manpower. It will take time for the city to enhance its capacity to receive visitors. Jang said the Tourism Board is spending over $200 million to promote the Hello Hong Kong campaign and offer incentives to travelers. Maisie Mock, HKIBC.